We have the men's 100 meters freestyle S6. Very much a mid-range classification here. Two lengths of the pool. And here's the lineup. Matthew Hannapel for Australia goes in lane one. Next to Volinsky from Israel. And Adriano de Lima, the experienced man from Brazil in three. Nelson Crispin, wow, what a championship he's had. Real breakthrough event for the Colombian. Talison Glock for Brazil in five. Dara McDonald, can he continue? The great job the Irish team are doing here. Second Colombian, Daniel Londono in seven. And the final swimmer is Ingvarsson. Portur Ingvarsson from Iceland. He's going in lane number eight. World record holder, not here. Anders Olsen, 105.45, set back in 2009. Tara McDonald, well, his entry time here to the final, 113.60. I'd expect him to go faster. But Nelson Crispin, well, <laughs> Colombia with one gold medal this week to Moses Fuentes Garcia. But Nelson Crispin has been on the medal podium another three times. Can he add a gold to his medal collection here in Montreal? No oh, what a fast <laughs> start. Crispin from Colombia in four, literally did fly through the air. Great strength and power for him off those starting blocks. I don't think of anybody, uh, I've not seen anybody react so very quickly. He really wants this one. And there he is, Nelson Crispin leading the field there. I expected Dara McDonald in lane six to be a little bit closer, but Nelson Crispin ahead of Talison Glock at the minute, he's coming in too. The turn now, Nelson Crispin, wow, 32.45, excellent swim there so far from the Colombian. 1.6 seconds ahead of De Lima, and Hannibal going well up there in lane number one. But Nelson Crispin, I don't think he's going to be caught. Talison Glock coming through for the Brazilians. The one-arm style of Talison Glock really pulling up now behind Nelson Crispin. Well, I thought it was all over a second ago, but Crispin is being challenged now by Glock. The turnover of the arms is really flying over from the Colombian. I think it's going to be a second goal at these championships for Colombia. He gets it. 110-01. Talison Glock in second, 110-51. And the third position in the outside lane goes to the Aussie. It's Matthew Hannibal from Australia, 111.40 ahead of Dara McDonald from Ireland. The man I picked out was a possible gold medalist. Well, there's a wonderful picture of the champion. My goodness, going out in 32 seconds. There's his oh. fast start into Ooh. the water. And off 32, wow. well, the dive's worth around the three seconds, two to three, if it's good, and it was good, we saw that. I really thought he could perhaps knock in a 68 point. He did die away and let Glock get back to him, nail biting at the end, of course. He really did use his early speed to full advantage. I'm sure next time, though, if he perhaps has a more balanced performance, he'll dip quite comfortably under the 110. The world record is 65-45, Anders Olsen of Sweden. He's not here, of course. Crispin is the new world champion. And if he can just master the natural speed that he has as an athlete, he will get faster and faster and faster. There's the finish. One arm stroke in it at the end. Nelson Crispin is a champion. He's delighted. What a championship he has had. Absolutely fantastic. Colombian team have been great. Colombia take the gold medal with Nelson Crispin, Talison Glock, the silver for Brazil, and Matthew Hannipal from Australia takes 